So think about the soaps and lotions you used this morning in the bathroom or the insecticide you used yesterday to get rid of the ants in your garden. You see, our daily life is very much determined by the use of chemicals, which also means that we leave a fingerprint of chemicals in our environment. So to make sure that we don't harm us or the environment, risk assessments are being performed. For environmental risk assessment, fish are actually used a lot. So one of the most widely used tests is the so-called acute fish toxicity test. In this test, fish are exposed in aquaria to increasing concentrations of the test chemical or the sample. After four days, you go there and you count how many fish have died. And you use this information to calculate the concentration which kills 50% of the fish. At the end, all fish have to be killed. Can you imagine what kind of brutal test this is for the fish? And still, millions of fish are used to perform this test. So we at Erwag thought there must be a better solution. Actually, we do not need fish anymore. Instead of fish, we now use cells, which were once isolated from fish and which we can culture in the laboratory indefinitely. We place these cells into tiny containers which substitute the aquaria. Instead of liters of water for the fish test, we now only need a few milliliters. And instead of kilograms of chemical, we get away with a very tiny amount.